as a drummer. You're conducting not only the orchestra that is the band on stage, but the orchestra that are the people in the audience. That audience relationship was a driving factor around why I pursued music so vehemently and why I have gladly spent my time as a broke musician. <laughs> but that's not sustainable. We need artists. We need artists. When I discovered blockchain technologies, it dawned on me that this could empower artists to continue to share their creativity with the world, which is an invaluable human resource. I played my first paying gig at age 14. I became so obsessed with playing drums and taking as many gigs as I could. It fed my soul, it fed my, it's kind of cliche to say that, but fed my creative spirit. I was behind that drum kit on various stages all over the world. Shows where the applause from the audience drowned out my thoughts. I was signed to an independent label and I'm getting millions of streams on digital distribution platforms. I felt that I had made it and yet I was still struggling to make ends meet. Where the money is for artists is in live performances, but when it comes to event ticketing, there's still a lot of unnecessary middlemen. We often call them brokers and scalpers or touts. These people buy up roughly 60% of tickets and then charge these exorbitant markups and sometimes unsuspecting fans show up at the door of the venue and they can't get in. It's a fake ticket. So it's a major problem. Just as the internet changed the way we communicate, blockchain is going to change the way we transact. For the first time in human history, there's this technology that shackles the brokers and scalpers. Blockchain allows for direct transactions between the artist and the fan. And the fan knows that the ticket is verified and authentic, and the money will go directly into the pocket of that artist. They're not adding any value. Get out of the way. The fundamental design of blockchain is you have a peer-to-peer -peer network. So I can do this transaction directly with you and trust that it's real. And you know what? I'm excited to go see the concert. The blockchain is open, transparent, and mutable. Anyone can go to a website and see the transactions happening, whereby it's incredibly hard to change a transaction once it has occurred. Transparency creates trust. Trust forms the basis of community. The real human truth about blockchain is it's not just about changing the way we transact money. It's about leveraging the technology's shared record of truth to establish trust between people, companies, or even nations, and exchange what we value, which is the whole point of a community. The human experience is tribal, and live experiences cannot be digitally replicated. When the music hits you, it's something very real and visceral and non-digital. It is just an incredible feeling. Music is inextricably a part of who I am. Because when it all comes crumbling down, we'll still have song and dance around the fire. We're still gonna tell stories. It's part of the human experience. And without it, we'd just be a bunch of ones and zeros. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.